So I just got done playing around with the tank. I added this cave in the back. And as you can see, it goes about almost halfway across the tank. So he could actually get under there pretty pretty farther than what he actually is right now. Um, I took the old filter out of the corner and I just completely took it out so now I only have two and pretty much I just drew some rocks and some of the sand up top I didn't really know what to do up there um, but yeah the cave this cave is actually made out of an old Tupperware container that I had bought for a little project but didn't really work out too well so I just cut the sides off two of the two of the sides I cut that side going down off and then this front face um, I left two sides rested this side on the old cave that he still has so his cave is now more of an L than just a whatever size rock, uh, shape that rock was but uh yeah, I, ho I hope he likes it because I don't really feel like taking it out, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. And uh, the last thing, I changed this filter. I put, I, ma I made it face so that it circles around the tank um, as like a current flow kind of thing. Try to make him seem more at home. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then... What I'm confused about, if anyone knows, I don't know if you can see those little floaty things. I know it's not food, but um, I've been seeing them all over, and it, and they're resting on top of the sand. I'm thinking they're uh, they're little balls of sand that manage to start floating. You see, like right here, but. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to fix that problem, and that's it as of now.